Dozens of people flocked the shoreline at Laniakea Beach, hoping to get a glimpse of the Hawaiian sea turtle. News of the slaughtering of Honey Girl, a frequent visitor to Turtle Beach, has generated even more interest in the threatened species. Look how much joy people get out of this, and then something like this, somebody does something horrible like that. It's terrible. But what happened Monday afternoon tugs at your heart even more. A large male, known as Kuhina, suddenly appeared on the shore and quietly made his way to a memorial that volunteers had set up for Honey Girl. They had to move the ropes aside so he could come straight up through and just came up and put his head right near the memorial, right near the picture, and just stayed. Kuhina stayed for hours. Volunteers say it appeared as if he never took his eyes off her picture. Heartbreaking to see those images, but it was also so touching just, you know, to see him come up and be so close to the memorial. It was almost like he was coming up to say goodbye. Visitors are moved by the powerful images. Hey, look at that. Quite unbelievable. Oh, wow. But what a, what a, nature's unreal, isn't it? I mean, it's just so fantastic. Sad. It's unbelievable. Yeah. Very sad. To me, this is heartbreaking. So, this, this is so sad. And it's like he's grieving. Sad. Very sad. Science often discourages attribution of human motivation or behavior in animals. This story provides a different perspective. The way we've given names to the individuals here, that is kind of borderline for me. But, but now I feel that it's, it's good to have those connections with the individuals. An example of nature teaching us a lesson on life. I think that they're more connected to their feelings probably than we are. So we can really learn something from them and from what he did. Because they know. Yeah. Very sad. I hope it doesn't happen again. Ron Mizutani, KHON 2 News.